How many miles did you run, Mr. Helene? I almost said brother Helene. Brother Helene. That's, a, that's what Connor and his wife call each other, brother and sister Ward. Sister okay, Ward. How, many, how many miles did you run? Seven. I asked that because Joel's freezing. Okay, you have to get in the shower. I ran seven miles. Let me clarify though. I ran seven miles as fast as I could, which was moderately fast. But the distance from the truck to this toilet, I sprinted this morning. Just, oh my God. scary. I typically would not do a step-by-step -step haircut for you guys, but I figure, guys, we are all in the same boat, and if you're all out there cutting your men's hair, maybe this <laughs> could help you. We've seen some bad quarantine haircuts. We have. If you're questioning doing bangs, I say do it. <laughs> Just go for it. Just, <laughs> just do it. If that's what you're wanting, I say do it. Yoko, you only quarantine once. <laughs> that's funny. Did you just make that I up? I did. Oh that my gosh, I get too good. Oh. Welcome to week six of quarantine. And yes, I literally, like I am, oh, I just go wash my face and brush my teeth. I haven't put my face on yet. You look so cute though. Well, thanks. Well, I start with a number three on every single one of my boys from Lincoln, which is so weird to say now. And I'm Do not- need to get my hair wet? I'm, no, oh. don't start with your hair wet. You're gonna take your clippers and you're going to just hold it flush and go, oh. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. It goes straight up off your head. Unless you're wanting to like take it all the way up to the part, which that's what I, do for Cody in Boston, but for Lincoln and Joel, I just go until the clippers come off their head. Let's get started. You'll wing it. You'll you'll learn. And this isn't going to be a full tutorial. It's to maybe give you an idea. So I'm not curving the clippers. I'm just taking it straight off the head. like scissor over comb on top just take another guard and do a guard over the whole top guys a buzz is going to be great it big, will be big safe. guards do you remember they when do. you used to use mine yeah like and I would, a quarter. yeah i would use the biggest one you can find on the top i'm going to take smaller clippers like this is a number two i'll go a little less high and then i'll use a number one go a little less high if that's what i'll do i'm going to do joel's eyebrows don't neglect the eyebrows i'm making the kids do the dishes right now so hopefully the kitchen's clean when i get done doubt it but i'm hopeful looks good uh -huh. yeah okay. to get that perfect angle you're gonna want your <laughs> your client to kneel down in the tub <laughs> It's perfect. It feels different. <gasps> it feels different combing on your hair right there. Really? Yes. Really? Yes. I can feel where you're... The rigid and robust hair? Yeah. That was wild. If you guys didn't know, Joel had hair transplant surgery. And I'm going to be taking his nine month pictures. Or what should have been nine month pictures. How, what month are we on right now? 11? <gasps> Stop it, are you serious? Good thing the camera's on so I don't have to yell at Joel. I'm not taking his nine month pictures! Joel, why didn't you take your nine month pictures? How many times did I ask you? I've had lots of things going. I'm going to get my makeup on while Joel trims his beard in the shower because I can't really do the other boy's hair until he's not in the shower anymore. And I probably wouldn't be putting makeup on today but I actually have a Zoom call with this new company, I'm not really sure. They have they they own a lot of cool brands that would go well with families, you know, like family, like family. Joe, what am I saying? <laughs> Their stuff is the same as family channels or both the family channels, I guess. No, like they own companies that families would like good branding. I don't know what well, apparently neither do I. I guess it's fine. <laughs> That's where I have a conference call. <laughs> yep, I guess. I was trying to explain to these guys like why I would be having that call. Okay, fine. The key to doing the guy's hair is below drying it. Except I let you blow dry it and I don't know if you blew it dry in the right direction. I blow dry it the way I've always done it. <laughs> well, I know you, but the way I do it. Oh, I did it the way my guy does it. 
I wanted to show you up close Joel's hairline. That's what his surgeon is kind of like known for is making the hairline uber natural. If you want to watch those videos, we'll put it in the description for you. There's a playlist. I feel like I'm really happy with the way your hair looks. Are you? Oh yeah, I'm thrilled about it. So you still have one more month until it's like, okay, this is your final product. Roughly, right? yeah. And they say sometimes you have to go a year, year and a half before the final is gone. Yeah. And that's kind of what I've learned too, is like if they say a year, it's more like a year and a half. Mm -hmm. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Cody, what is the very first question that you asked? Here, you hold that. What's the question you ask? And he asks this every time. How long is it gonna take? Is this gonna take a long time? How long is this gonna take? And what do I say every time? <laughs> the same. It's gonna take the same amount of time that it did last time. Okay, I'm gonna start with the number three guard again. I think that's a pretty safe number. It's not too short, it's not too... Anyway, so I'm going to do the exact same thing. Oh, that's not taking anything off. Okay, we're gonna do number two. Just kidding. Number three is not taking anything off. So many people have a hard time with necklines, so I'm just going to show this to you without speeding it up, without skipping any parts. I put the chin down and I determine how short I want it to go. And if you look at these two sides right here, I kind of come to the bottom before it starts tapering down. And that's about where you can want to go straight across. It depends on each different person, but I'll come about here. And the first thing I do is go straight across. Just make one straight line with your trimmers. One straight line like that. And then I work up from there. So you can either keep it square like this, or you can round it. I like to round it just a little bit and go up on the side just like that. guys on Joel's and Lincoln's hair I go straight up and just take my clippers up from there but with Boston and Cody I round the clippers up on their head and I take it all the way up to their part just because that's how I've got it styled and then on the crown of their head I only go to like here and then I round down clippers up here and then kind of round it down right there and then when you get to turn around when you get to this side I just stop where you would normally stop right up in here going straight off the head White rings of fire. Do you know how hard it is to get Lincoln to hold still? Holding your head, my back is like breaking right now. entire vlog was going to be in my bathroom but anyway um I always clean up after my mess while the boys are showering so I went down and I was helping them shower getting them all cleaned up now I'm just making sure all the hair is cleaned up in the bathroom before I move on and get their hair fixed and I always fix it so I know what it looks like so if I made a mistake I can fix it while I still have all my like tools out it's just a good excuse to get cleaned up right now what did you just ask me when you came upstairs why are we dressed so nice and <laughs> well so you guys can tell i haven't got my kids dressed haven't done their hair basically since school was out i wanted you guys to look a little bit nicer and i feel like sit when we get up and we get dressed and we get going for the day you have more energy i feel happier when i get up and get ready believe me i love those days like I am a bum through and through. Like I could lay in bed and watch TV all day, not get out of my robe. You guys have seen that many days, but I feel like today, got up, got ready, and I'm getting the kids ready, and it just feels better. Like I feel better. What do you think? Good. 
Boston loves having his hair done, don't you? Mm-hmm. There's Boston's haircut. Oh, sorry, bathroom's a little small. Have to scoot back. Boston, you look so handsome. Look right at me so I can see how handsome you look. So cute. Okay, go tell Lincoln to come here. Baby, sit. Okay. <laughs> Good girl, lady. I don't know if I really want it. I've been sneaking them all day. I'm full. Yeah, well, I always tell the kids, I'm like, zip the bag up when you're done or else lady sneaks them. It doesn't matter. How old your child is, or what animal your child is, they will sneak treats. Look at her. Do you see where she's going? Her. See how the bag is left open? Let's fix your hair. Lincoln's got some calyx right in the front. So we're trying to accommodate for those. Lincoln has super fine hair, and my other boys have a little more coarse of hair, but this product still works for all of them. I just try to not use so much of it on Lincoln. You have the craziest little calyx and swirls. He has a swirl in the back too. Wow. What do you think? Good. How do you zoom in? You don't need to zoom in. <laughs> Wowie. So handsome, Lincoln. And the back. And the back. Look at me. Can I see how cute your face looks? Okay, we're all done. Thanks for hanging out with me while I did all four boy haircuts today. Oh, P.S. I'm going to link their t-shirts in the description because when I was at Walmart, I bought them, but I've been doing a lot of online Walmart shopping. I think it's the way to go, guys. If you guys enjoyed it, go ahead and give the vlog a thumbs up. If you are new to our channel, we would love to have you subscribe, and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye, guys.